You're listening to the A to Z English podcast. Welcome to the A to Z English podcast. My name is Jack and I'm here with my co-host Social and today we've got a would you rather question. And Social today's would you rather question is would you rather receive a really expensive gift that someone bought for you or receive a really thoughtful gift that someone made for you. Wow, Jack, this one is hard. And because I know that you're going to answer the thoughtful route, at least that's what I think I know, um, (laughs) I'm going to go against the grain here and say I'd rather get a really expensive gift. Okay. Because a gift that was made for me is going to be an item that is going to take up space in my house. And I have so many things already at my age. I don't really need anything else that I can think of. And when I think of a expensive gift i think something like some memory building gift like like a flight or uh some money or something that i could use however i want which i would put towards traveling um and i think that that would ultimately be more valuable to me because i would have those memories forever um and it wouldn't just be something that's like losing value with time in fact those memories will be so special in more time and you could document them with photos because everyone's got a phone with a camera now right exactly so how about you jack how do you feel i i mean i like that you 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 bring this up a lot but it's it's really important the experience gift you know like you you talk about that a lot i could tell that like you're that left a a big impression on you The last time you had your when your boyfriend gave you that that gift of the uh, experience trip. And so I think I really like uh, a huge advocate now of that. I really like that because I think we have too much stuff. Um, However, if I had to choose between an expensive gift, like a thing, not an experience and um, and some and a gift that someone made for me. I'll I'll take the the thing that someone made for me. So you're right. You you called it correctly. Um uh-huh. you know, if someone especially like like if someone made me a jacket or uh painted me uh you know, a a portrait or something like that. Those are so they're unique. Like there's only one of those in the whole world. And and usually when people do that, it's not just like I'm not a painter and I'm going to paint Jack a, 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 a portrait. A portrait. <laughs> yeah. It's people who are very skilled at what they do. And then they, mm-hmm. and then they, then they use that skill, that trade to make something for you. So whenever I've gotten those kinds of gifts that people made, it's, it's from people who are professionals at making stuff. So they might be like, uh, you know, one of their hobbies could be, making uh leather wallets or leather belts or something like that and they can put the design in it and so if someone takes the time to make that those are the best i i love those those items and i love i love wearing those kinds of items like when they're when it's clothing um because people will compliment you be like where did you buy where did you get that belt i like that is so cool and you're like no you can't buy in a store like this is a one of a kind, right. you know, and I, I love those kinds of items. I think they're so cool. And uh, yeah, because it's unique. So that that's my my feeling. But if, if like I said, like what you said, um, if I had an experience opportunity, I think those are great because you're helping the local economy. You're not it's not going to it's not an item that's going to end up in a garbage pile, you know, it's it's right. it's very eco friendly. So I think the experience gift is an amazing choice as well. Yeah, I agree with that. But I do like your perspective as well, Jack. Where you you know it is something that generally when someone's making a, a thoughtful gift for you, it's like you said, someone using a skill that they have to make something really incredible for you. I do remember when I was in high school, I had a friend who she 
could make like duct tape wallets that are really cool. Mm. And she made one for the band that I really liked um, at that time and gifted that to me for my birthday. And it was really nice. Nice. I still have it to this day, um, just because yeah. I was so flattered and happy to get it. So I, I do, I do see the value in that as well. Um, but yeah, let us know, guys. What do you think? Would you rather have a thoughtful gift that someone made for you, or an expensive gift that someone bought for you? Let us know in the comments down below at a to z English Podcast dot com. Shoot us an email at a to z English Podcast at gmail dot com, or write to us in our WhatsApp group. And we will see you guys next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.